Madness Sports. Jets quarterback Sam Darnold out with a shoulder injury this week, so in steps Super Bowl 47 MVP Joe Flacco. Darnold diagnosed with a sprained right shoulder he suffered during last week's loss to the Denver Broncos. He's considered week to week, so the reins of Adam Gase's potent and deadly New York Jets offense handed to Flacco, who signed with the Jets in May. Jets 0-6 when Darnold has not started over the past three seasons. Gase says holding out the quarterback this week against Arizona is the correct move. Our doctors, you know, second opinions, you know, just making sure, you know, we do the right thing, not only, not, not only by him, you know, just, you know, the immediate future, long term. Um, so, I mean, he's really going to be week to week right now. Um, that was really kind of the, what we were told by the doctors of let's just kind of see how, how well he feels after, after this week of rest. Um, so that's kind of where we're at right, right now with him. The good news for the Jets, running back Le'Veon Bell expected to play this week after missing three games with a hamstring injury. Elsewhere around the AFC East, reigning defensive player of the year, Stephon Gilmore has tested positive for coronavirus. Gilmore becomes the second New England Patriot in the past week to test positive, joining quarterback Cam Newton, who was held out of Monday night's game against the Chiefs. Gilmore is asymptomatic. The Patriots did cancel practice today and tomorrow in response. Players and coaches around the league reacted to the news this afternoon. Not much is different for me. Just still staying inside and not, not going out to restaurants too much, just kind of sticking to my business. But um, to me, it's not that damn hard. Just wear your mask. We all want to play football. Um, so everybody's got to do it. Just do it. we got to always be ready to, to adjust to what's going on. And we're trying to learn from what's going on and, and see if there's something that we can do better. Patriots scheduled to play the Broncos at home Sunday afternoon. Coming up at 6.20 in Eyewitness Sports, what were the Yankees doing last night is the question many are asking. Starter Davey Garcia only went one inning before giving way to Jay Happ, who made a mess of things. Gave up uh, lots of earned runs in just two and two-thirds innings. We'll hear from the manager on that decision. In the National League Game 2 of the Marlins Braves series this afternoon, we'll update you on that. And Carson Wentz spoke to the media ahead of the big game Sunday against the Steelers. We'll hear from the starting quarterback. That's all coming up at 620, but stay right there because Eyewitness News at 6 starts now.